why diabetes mellitus and diabetes insipidus are called diabetes mellitus and diabetes insipidus. There's an interesting story behind this, that the word diabetes actually basically means that you are passing out a lot of urine. So long time back, people noted that there are two conditions classically where they, the patient usually pass a lot of urine. And that time the diagnostic medicine pathology was not so sophisticated at that point of time. So in one case, when the patient is passing a lot of urine, they used to dip their finger, they used to test that urine, and they also noted that uh, sometimes animals also love that kind of urine because it tastes honey-like. So mellitus, the word mellitus basically means honey-like, sweet. So they named that disease where the patient is passing a lot of urine and the urine tastes honey-like, diabetes mellitus. Another disease, the urine is tasteless. Insipid means, the word means tasteless because diabetes insipidus occurs due to the deficiency of the ADH. So only the patient is passing water excess. And water is testless. So that's why this disease is not got the name diabetes insipidus. So there are basically two diseases there. One is diabetes mellitus and diabetes insipidus. Both the cases patient present with polyuria, but in one case excess of urine. But in one case, our ancestor, the doctors in the ancient time, they also noted that the urine is very sweet because in diabetes mellitus, what is happening? The patient is basically passing glucose with the urine. So that's why it tastes honey-like, very sweet. So that's why they call the name diabetes mellitus. Mellitus means honey-like. Another disease, diabetes insipidus, which is basically a pathology of the posterior pituitary. And also because what happens in diabetes insipidus, the patient is not synthesizing actually. And sometimes also the kidney is not also acting accordingly. ADH, anti-diabetic hormone. So these two diseases and the urine, the patient basically passes a lot of urine, which is tasteless, insipid. And that's why this condition is called diabetes insipidus, because insipid means tasteless, bland. For example, I can say that I went into a Italian restaurant yesterday and the food was insipid, tasteless. So that's how the disease, these two diseases got its name. Diabetes mellitus, where the patient passes a lot of urine, the urine is honey-like, and diabetes insipidus, insipid means tasteless, but the patient also passes a lot of urine, but the urine is who are tasteless because it's basically passing a lot of water.